Welcome to our today's video on urticaria commonly known as hives. Urticaria results from the release of histamine and prostaglandins from mast cells in a type 1 hypersensitivity response. It presents as sharply demarcated edematous plaques with surrounding erythema also known as wheel and flare with each lesion lasting less than 24 hours. Urticaria can be acute or chronic if last more than 6 weeks. During history and physical examination, urticaria lesions or wheels are observed as erythematous or white transient papules or plaques representing dermal edema. These lesions may be widespread. In severe cases, urticaria can lead to extracutaneous manifestations such as tongue swelling, angioedema, asthma, gastrointestinal symptom, joint swelling and fever. Acute urticaria is often a response to various triggers including food, drugs, viruses, insect bites or physical stimuli like cold, heat or sun exposure. Chronic urticaria on the other hand is usually idiopathic. Diagnosis relies on characteristic exam findings and patient history, positive dermatographism, the formation of wheels when the skin is stroked may aid in diagnosis. If in doubt, a serum tryptase test can be conducted as it is co-released with histamine from mast cells, helping to confirm the diagnosis. However, determining the exact cause of urticaria can often be challenging. Treatment involves systemic antihistamines for managing urticaria. In rare cases of anaphylaxis, immediate intervention with intramuscular epinephrine, antihistamines, IV fluids and airway support is necessary. Understanding the triggers and manifestations of urticaria is crucial for prompt diagnosis and effective management. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more educational content like this.